The 27th participant in the Silva Challenge is Shane from the Backyard Choppers YouTube channel. Now, a while back, Shane saw this casting, the Motosaurus. It has rubber fins on it. Uh, he saw me open this, or he saw it in one of the tubs, or I'm not quite sure if it was in maybe one of the boxes, the uh, black boxes, but when he saw it, he said he had an idea for it, for when he, his name came up in the challenge. So I've set it aside since then. And since his turn is up, he gets to have this thing. And I'm anxious to see what he has planned for it. I also have this, geez, I don't know, kind of looks like a Suzuki, Yamaha, anything, Lord only knows. Old uh, like dirt bike that I'm throwing in here. And now, to the tubs. <laughs> I've always liked construction vehicles for gas van style builds. I think they give you a lot of opportunity to be creative. Here's an old Tonka. Uh, it doesn't really say what it is, but this looks pretty cool. So I'm gonna throw that in there. I need something that flies, so here's a chopper. That's a Sea Hunter. That's an old matchbox. Well, not that old of a matchbox, but a matchbox nonetheless. <laughs> There's something I like about throwing trains. I keep waiting for somebody uh, to take one of the trains and really go like a steampunk direction in it, with it. Um, so hey, maybe this time, or who knows what Shane will do with that. Lord only knows. 70 Buick GSX. That's a Hot Wheels. Apparently, yeah, it doesn't, doesn't really say Hot Wheels on it though, but I, I believe, yeah, there we go. There's the Hot Wheels logo. So I'll throw that in here. That <laughs> what the hell is this? Um, this is from DC Comics. Huh. It's got to be something Mr. Freeze related. Would be my guess. It doesn't say. But it definitely has like a Mr. Freeze feel to it. Oh, that's kind of cool. That's Hot Wheels. Doesn't have a name on it, but... Uh, that has a real classic look to it. Huh. Even though there's a chopper in there, I think I'll throw in this. Poison arrow. Yeah, you can use the wings and fins off of that for something. Get that to fit in there. I hope you all are enjoying these silver challenges. I know I am. <laughs> now, that's a Lego related thing. Yeah, the Lego group for McDonald's. Yeah, I'm not going to stick you with that thing, Shane. Even I'm not that cool. Oh, wow. Check this out. This is cool. What is this? Matchbox Rotwheeler. Okay, given the one that you asked for, this kind of follows that theme in a way. So, uh, oh, that's an old Husky Studebaker. Yeah, I might do something with that. I'll set that aside. Oh, here you go. There's something that could go a gas line's direction without too much work. That's a Hot Wheels... Something. Yeah, the wheels are obviously screwed up. I know the noise throws the microphone way off, but, uh, oh. Now, let's see what you can do with something this incredibly bland. <laughs> That's a Scion 
XD? XB. Cyan XB. Yeah, that's about as bland as it's gonna get. Oh, there's something cool. Sweet 16, I think, is what that says on it. It's missing a few pipes. <laughs> yeah, some of these castings have, have been through hell. As I recall, this batch, also when I got it, had a bunch of cat hair in it. And that's I was going to say, this has got to be DC Comics related, too. So that's obviously Joker related. You know, that... Yeah, the green, purple, the, the smile. That's actually pretty cool. That, that's kind of a cool cast. Eesh. 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 <laughs> oh, it's another Husky Studebaker. It's the Wagoneer. But, uh, yeah, same casting done in two different ways. Oddly enough, this Husky has like purple glass on the back and clear on the front. But, yeah, set those aside. I gotta mess with something. Well, there's the bottom half of something. Mercedes coach. This looks like it's the middle of something. There you go. Let's go Gaslands with the uh, tanker truck. Old shell tanker truck. That's a little loose on there, but I'm sure you can have fun with that. Delivering water in the wastelands, right? What the heck? I think... I think that's about it for the box. The box is actually... Eesh. Surprisingly full. That's a Maisto casting. Bah ha ha ha. Yeah, I think. See, I could see you taking that seat off, putting some, or putting a gun in front of this. The bah ha 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 from Ma Maisto. Maisto. Oh, and it has a screw loose. There's obviously something that's supposed to be there, but uh, isn't. It's it's not. But if I can get this in here some way, I will. Yeah, I can make it fit. Okay. So, scoot that over. I used to have a coworker who talked about scooching things over to make them fit. That's... Okay, well I'm jamming a red wine tow truck in here. That'll fit. And the Baja... <laughs> oh, come on. What do you know? It works. <laughs> Barely. <laughs> so those are the castings. Let's throw some junk in here. Okay. Here's just assorted junk. Wheels and I, I'm not even gonna see if the wheels match. There's guns, and odds and ends. And ram bars and stuff and, and yeah <laughs> and some kind of ray gun <laughs> just cuz and a couple engines another engine that's that tub and then I need to print more skulls you get getting low on skulls but hey have some skulls and have some more skulls and some tanks and some jerry cans and <laughs> I think that's it Shane 
<laughs> so, everybody, thanks for watching these videos. I'm, I'm having a heck of a good time doing these, putting these together, and seeing what people do with them. I hope you're having even a fraction of the amount of fun that I'm having. Um, I hope you're having at least that watching these. So, um, everybody, stay safe and healthy out there. Shane, have fun with this, and uh, catch y'all in the next one.